Now, did you know that only 1.5% of YouTube channels do actually test success? In other words, 98.5% of the channels actually fail in the process. Now, this might amaze you, but this is a fact that most of the channels which are successful on YouTube follow a certain pattern. They have analysis of the keywords that are going to help them get views. They have trend alerts. They also have a watch on their competitors as well. Now, all of this you can do via a tool which is called vidIQ. I'm quite sure if you are into YouTube, you must have heard about vidIQ. But what I'm quite sure about is that you are not knowing all the features that vidIQ has. So in this little tutorial, I'll go through all of the professional features that are inside of vidIQ, which can help you to grow your channel, increase your views, get top ranking, and the best part, get more money for your channel. With that being said, without further ado, this is going to be a step-by-step -step tutorial don't miss out on anything don't skip watch it till the end because you are going to get some awesome value and the best part as always for my subscribers there's going to be a gift at the end of this video so please do stick around with me till the end of this video without further ado let's jump onto my laptop and let me show you step by step how to read iq hey guys welcome to this vid iq complete tutorial and as you can see i'm within the dashboard of my vid iq over here now VidIQ actually allows you two ways of accessing. One is this standalone web platform, as you can see over here. And the other is right from within YouTube using a Chrome extension. As you can see over here, I've got this installed as well. So I'll actually cover both of them in this extensive VidIQ tutorial. So with that being said, first, let me go through this standalone web application that they have. You just need to go over to the link below in the description. You can just sign up for absolutely free of cost. It doesn't cost you a penny. Absolutely free to sign up. You can go ahead and sign up with your email, which has YouTube. That helps you to integrate the YouTube channel seamlessly. Now, once you have done that, you are going to get something like this. This is what the dashboard of VQ looks like. Now, in here, you can see your channel stats over a time. Say seven days, you can check it out for 30 days or even all time if you wish to. Then you have the daily task over here. These are the tasks that VidIQ suggests you to go for. Like they have tutorials, they have everything like your goal progress tracking. They have your video posting goals, all of that track so that you are on the right path. And also they have given you a growth plan progress as well in which you can go follow this and achieve the growth. With that being said, these are all on the dashboard. You can check out over here. But... There are separate tabs for each of the features. So I'm kind of more interested in going through that because that gives you additional control over everything. So let's go ahead and check out the first feature that it has, which is daily ideas. So if we click on that, you can see over here, you can generate daily ideas based on your channel. So that's a great thing to have. As you can see over here, I have got all of these suggestions from VidIQ. And then I have got in here the view predictions. That is the number of views that I can get. As you can see, these are all very high, right? Now I can click on this and I can actually sort it from lower to higher as well. But I prefer getting from highest to the lowest. So in here, I can find out a ton of video ideas that VidIQ is suggesting me. That being said, if you click on this, okay, you can go ahead and actually generate more personalized ideas as well. So that being said, if you wish to actually copy these ideas, you can one click select all, you can copy them or you can download them as well. That's up to you. Now that being said, that is what VidIQ is suggesting. Say for example, you want to check out idea on a specific keyword. You can just scroll all the way down over here and you can enter the keyword on which you want the idea. Say for example, I wish to make videos on affiliate marketing. Enter affiliate marketing over here and click on apply. Now, as soon as I do so, you can see it has actually generated a set of other ideas as well, like passive income alert, how to make money while you sleep with affiliate marketing. Sounds good. Right? Then it has all this view prediction as well. You can go ahead and check out them at your own time. So in this way, you can actually create your daily ideas. Now, if you were to search this on YouTube and prepare it for yourself, it would have taken you minimum 10 days to generate 50 video ideas. But in here, you can do it in minutes. So that's a great advantage to have. Now, the second thing that I wish you to know is keywords you can just come over keywords it's very very important and interesting concept over here so in here you can search for keywords say for example you want to create uh videos on affiliate marketing again because i'm just thinking that your niche is affiliate marketing just for an example it can be travel it can be weight loss it can be anything that you wish to right? you can just enter that niche over here the keyword and hit on enter as soon as you do so you will get everything regarding the volume as you can see over here you can find the search volume then you can find the competition and then based on that search volume and competition it gives you an overall score now the higher the overall score is the better opportunity you have so it is giving me an overall score of 75, which is actually a great, great thing to have. So it suggests you depending on the channel that you have, depending on the 
data that is there on your channel so it's quite personalized that being said in here you can find the related keywords if you scroll down over here you can find the matching terms and you can find the questions as well the questions are how to related videos on that keyword as you can see now with that being said uh, if you scroll up over here you can see uh, each tab on this tab there is related keywords so if i go over there you can see all the related keywords i can get from here i can get their overall score i can get their search volume i can get their competition all of that so that's a great great thing to have as as you can see over here this thing also has a good potential like 67 overall score is a good one to consider affiliate marketing for beginners so i can go ahead and maybe i can create a video on this one right? then you can go over to the matching terms matching terms means there needs to be this word over here affiliate marketing so you can see over here pinterest affiliate marketing 78 quite amazing amazon affiliate marketing 69 in fact i used to rank for amazon affiliate marketing as well so yeah it's work it works definitely then you can see over here affiliate marketing for beginner clickbank affiliate marketing all of these have a good potential 73 75 70 78 again so these are quite good keywords that you can target right then if you are into how to videos that is if you are doing how to videos then you can just come over to this questions click on that and this will give you all the how to questions that you want to be answered right in here as you can see how to start affiliate marketing 62 which is a good one to have but all the other how to's are quite competitive as you can see over here so in here as you can see how to add products to tiktok shop affiliate marketing this one again has 67 score which means quite good it has a quite good search volume as well and the competition as you can see is low over here so this suggests that this can be a good keyword to target so this is another important part in where you can do all the keyword research that you wish to now once you are happy with it you can come back to the overview tab as well and in here you can find all the videos that are exceedingly doing well on youtube on this keyword right? so you can go ahead you can model these videos and create the video scripts and the video details based on that right? so that you are immediately so that you are following the path of something which has been already successful. So with that being said, that's how it happens and that's how easy it is to do the keyword research using FeedIQ. Now the next step that I want you to know is the competitor. In here you can come over this competitor and you can find your competitor based on these things like views, subscribers, public videos, average daily views, average subscriber per day and average public videos per day. Now all these data you can monitor from any of your competing channels. Right? Say for example in here if you wish to add any competitor you you can come over here and you can select for that channel that is you can search for that and from here you would get those search results you can just select that and boom it would be added as a competitor as you can see over here and on this you would get the graphical data as you can see over here it's a comparative data that you get you can compare it for last 30 days you can compare it for last 60 days or even 12 months that's up to you so it has got you covered with everything now if you wish to go for detailed data like the views uh, the views gained and everything like uh, if you want to see the channel stats you can check that over here at one glance as well you can also go ahead and find their top performing videos so that you can actually take inspiration from them and create your masterpiece as well so that's quite amazing stuff to have this is one of the most important factors in getting consistent views and understanding the way the industry is moving towards so this is very important tab to keep an eye for now the next tab that i wish you to know is the subscriber tag now in here you can get the details like top videos that have been watched by your subscribers that means what all videos are your subscribers watching so that you can get the topics that you should look on to to create new videos on right? then you can find all the top channels that your subscribers are subscribing to so this can indicate what your subscribers want which type of channel they are interested in so that you can go ahead study those channels and then you can find what all videos are there so that you can model your videos based on those as well and last but not the least is the best time to post this gives you the data like when your subscribers are active on youtube so that you can actually you can actually publish your videos at that time to get the maximum attention right? the next step that they have is the seo so we can go over there and in here they have two things one of them is bulk seo the bulk seo actually allows you to update things like say for example you want to the titles you want to update your affiliate link you, you might want to update your description whatever you want to do you can come over here and you can update it from here it's one click and boom you can do that then you can check out all the tabs then you can check out all the tags that are recommended by vidiq and all the 
current tags that you have now from the current tags you can find the number of views that each of these tags is bringing to your video so you can actually take a look at these and if you want to remove anything or add anything you can do that right from here so this is going to be a good one to have so you can see over here it has given me all of the data historic data and all of the current data everything is available over here the next thing that we have is channel wide tag and in this thing we can actually find the channel wide tags for any channel that you wish to you can just target a date range and you can find your channel wide tag as well then there's another tab called the events in here you can find all the events that is going around so that you can actually find an event if you are interested in that event you can actually go ahead and join this as well you can see all of these go events are going around so you can actually collaborate you can network with them so it's a good opportunity for you as well now that being said vidiq has also implemented two brilliant ai features in their premium tool one of them is called ai generator if you come over here this can actually help you to generate everything for your videos say for example like how to lose weight without exercise and let's hit on generate and in here it has given you all the related keywords as you can see it has given you the title it has also given you the description it has also given you the tags as you can see and it has also given you the thumbnails that you can use as a background apart from this it has given you the hook it has given you the outline and it has also given you a button over here to generate a video script for you so if we go ahead and click on this it actually creates the video script for us and as you can see, it has been created over here. This uh, looks quite good. You can go ahead and make any changes if you wish to. You can feel free to do that. Once you are happy, you can just click on copy and you can use it with any other software that you wish to. Or you can also have this voiceover. Now, this is completely done for you by VidIQ. So if I play this. Hey there, welcome back to our channel. Today, I have a mind-blowing fact to share with you. You know that you can actually... So you can see that it's quite a good quality to have. With that being said, that's it regarding AI generator. So it can help you with all your SEO process at one go. Apart from this, it has got you also covered with this brand new feature called AI Coach. And this has two feeds over here, as you can see. This is advanced. So this actually uses your channel data. You can ask it anything relevant to your channel and it will give you answer based on your channel statistics and your channel data. And the other one, as you can see over here, is the basic. Now, this is all in general about YouTube. So if you wish to ask it anything, like how to rank my videos and click on send, it is like having a chat GPT of your own. And it goes ahead and writes all of these things for you. Now, again, as I told you, this is the basic thing. So if you wish to ask it anything personalized, then you need to go for the advanced one as well. So that's it regarding the standalone platform. And this is how it works. Now, I, as I have already told you, I'm going to also show you the features that it has on its extension. So if we go over to YouTube over here, I will actually go through the few things that are not there in the standalone program, but here on this extension. So if you actually open up the YouTube in which BitIQ is linked, you can find this tab over here. Just click on this three horizontal bars. And from here, you get two things which you are not getting on there. One is called the trend alerts and the other is called the channel audit. Now, first of all, let's go for the trend alerts. Just click on that. And in here, what you can do is that you can create a brand new alert. Now, why should you create this alert? This is to know if something is going trendy in YouTube. That is globally. Right? Say, for example, there is a video on AI tool that has broken all the trends that is getting a huge views per hour. So you can just give it a name like AI tool watch just for an example. And then the keyword. So definitely it's going to be AI tool. And then I would like to receive mail every day. I don't want to waste time. I want to know exactly whichever video is making trend. And then on the advanced option, I can give like a uh, competitor detail, like whose videos to watch for. I can also give how many views per hour a video must have so that I can consider it as a trend. So I can have it 100, 500, 1k, 5k or 10k. Now, as soon as some video is breaking the trends, going viral on YouTube globally, I'll get a message regarding this watch out this video this is creating a trend so i will be the first one to jump onto this trend and as you might be knowing if you are creating a trending video it is definitely going to help you to grow and there is a huge chance you might also go viral so this is a great great feature in vidiq that being said that was about the trend alert there is another feature which is called the channel audit so if i click on that you can see over here this is the channel audit that we have and in here you can find details like what are the views per hour that you are getting? What is the engagement rate? What are the views? What are the subscribers gained? That is which of your videos are performing well. Then if you scroll further down over here, you can see over here the content that could use work. That means these contents haven't been so productive. So in here, you can find what is their lowest average watch time, lowest retention and lowest views. So you can work on these videos to get a better results. Right? And then you can see the actionable SEO score on your channel 
as on my case you can see its average is 45 which is quite good out of 50 and then the tags length tag description is quite well all of these you can check out at a daily basis to know the health of your channel so this is called the channel audit report you can actually take a look at this to stay updated with how your channel is performing now with that being said as i already told you all of the things that i've shown you from the standalone thing can be done from here like daily ideas competitors most viewed keyword inspector achievements all of these are available from this one over here as well so that being said that's how this extension works now if we if i wish to actually go ahead and check out any video and inspect that i can just go ahead and click on the video we have major awesome updates for leonardo ai and as you can see today, the video has opened up now let me pause this in here you can see the de detailed statistics of the video like the video the engagement that it's getting the overview of the thing like uh, overview of the channel you can find over here you can find the things related to the video engagement views per hour all of these you can find from here so all of these are coming from vidIQ then if you scroll down over here so you can find all these details from vidIQ regarding a specific video as well so all of these are possible so to get best result I would recommend you to install this Chrome extension as well right now that being said vidIQ as I already told you is absolutely free to use you can just sign up using the link below in the description and if you are looking to go for a paid plan like some of the features that I've shown on this video are on the paid plan and uh Although you can start for absolutely free, but if you are looking to grow your channel, then vidIQ is something that I would definitely suggest you. Yeah, but if you wish to actually go for any paid plans, I am here to make things easier for you. I will be sharing you with a coupon code, which you can find in the description below and also on the screen. And you can apply that to get a 50% discount as well. So again, if you wish to get started, just click the link below, apply the coupon code and boom, you can start up for free of course. So that being said, it brings me to an end of this complete VDIQ tutorial. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, help me with a like and let me know in the comment section if you have got any questions regarding any part of this complete VDIQ. We'll meet again pretty soon somewhere over the internet. Until then, please take care of yourself and your families and don't forget to keep making money on. Signing off is Shine from Review Shine. Take care. Bye-bye.